new research. I'm listening. Mm Humanity is very weak. That's why humans need us so desperately. Now what do you want? Go on, I'm waiting. Human child, what do you need?
If it's new research, I'm listening. child. What do you need? I have pinpointed the location where all of the Ironheart traces converge. It is hidden within the facility of the Legion of Immortality. I can detect a continuous Ironheart pulse and particles, as well as a small amount of energy from this place. And they seem to be moving. I recommend we investigate this place, Descendant. I'll need you to lend me your strength. Sharon, I will stay behind and retrieve the cache of Volgus experiment records. I'm sure they'll contain valuable information. I'll enter the inner facility first. Join me when you're ready.
Most of the main passageways are now either blocked or destroyed. It appears the enemy intends to destroy the entire facility. Air vents, drainage pipes, maintenance ducts. Use any available alternative means of escape that you can. Sharon, I've restored some of the data from the Vulcan's experiment record. According to these records, the facility during the private laboratory of General Amon of the Legion of Immortality. As it was iron heart traces which led us to this place, Corell and Eamon might actually be there. It won't be an easy fight if they are. Sharon? Awaiting your transmission. The traces of the iron heart detected here. There. Um, never mind. I will let you know after I've performed further analysis. Uh, okay, guys. Synchronize the alarms with the nuclear reactor's self-destruct switch. What the hell are they thinking? They'd rather take everyone and everything with them than give up the iron heart. I can modify the circuitry. Find the alarms and destroy them. Deactivated reactor. Turn on the coolers. I'll continue tracking the iron heart traces. Units transmitting critical operation details. From the restored Volgus experiment records, I've reconstructed an audio recording that seems to have been made during the time of the experiments. Listen. The Legion will become greater through the Iron Heart. Rise, my warriors. Give your lives for the Iron 
parts already gone. Reload. So this is why the trace is felt. Displaced. Descendant, in order to increase the accuracy of our pursuit, we need to access all the data on Vulgus units who were transformed using the Iron Heart. You must defeat Al Zarok. Sharon, will you relay a detailed report of this to HQ? Will do. I'll be on my way. Good hunting. inverting the Ironheart data. If you do that, we won't be able to decipher the unidentified guide code. And Enough! The Ironheart data must be reconfigured in order to destroy the dimensional wall. I don't have time to think about that! Increase. The roars of the Vulgus 
will fill this land with fear! Descendant, I have the results of the operation from Sharon. Alpha is tied up with an emergency meeting with the Magisters. I have been ordered to brief you on the follow-up operation. Please make your way to HQ. Think that strategic planning excellent work descendant this operation has yielded many results both positive and negative firstly all of hq is encouraged by the possibilities presented by the guide although we were unsuccessful in our retrieval of the iron heart thanks to the guide's tracking function we uncovered the vulgus restricted zone and alzarok this proves the guide's tracking system exists and is operational However, the ingenuity that the Vulgus demonstrated with their use of the Ironheart was alarming. So much so, that the Magisters requested an emergency meeting with Alpha. In particular, the inversion of the Ironheart ordered by Corral is something we must understand, no matter the cost. From this point forward, HQ plans to adopt the Guide's tracking functionality and the various other information sources they offer as official operational elements. The Descendants will soon be deployed throughout Ingress. Use the Guide to track the Ironheart and proceed with the mission to investigate the Inversion Procedure. Humanity's full-scale counterattack has officially begun. However, I know you have just completed a difficult mission. Until the official deployment order is given, please go ahead with whatever preparations you need to make. The Magisters have promised their full commitment to support research efforts, so this is the perfect opportunity to request anything you need from Anais. Before you go, Descendant, I have a personal request. Can you retrieve the Alzarok autopsy report from Jeremy? The report was intended for delivery to the Magisters. Jeremy requested a brief look at it, and I haven't heard from him since. I understand things are strained between you and Jeremy due to the recent operation, but I hope you'll do this anyway. Descendant, just in case, I hope you're not disappointed that Jeremy wasn't punished. I actually saw Alpha slap Jeremy earlier. No one enjoys seeing their superior do something like that, but I believe it was a more appropriate punishment than a court-martial. I'm sure that Jeremy has also learned his lesson.
think you're the only one. What the? You're... I was just reading the report on Alzarok and thinking, wouldn't it be great if he, you know, killed you? Anyway, looks like he got to experience something interesting, at least. A Vulgus redesigned by the Ironheart. Wow. Now, that's an area that fascinates me. If I knew you'd be seeing that, I would have stuck with the operation instead of dropping out. And I wouldn't have been slapped by Alpha. <laughs> anyway, why are you here? I'm in a bad enough mood already after Sharon and her minion drop by to give me a piece of their minds? What? Nell wants the report? Ah, so you're her gopher. You really are something. You can take it and buzz off. You probably don't have time to argue with me anyway. Sharon mentioned earlier that the guide isn't in the best shape. All these so-called grown-ups having fun with their imaginary friend. Oh, get lost. You're annoying me. between the archae of different descendants in order to find Arnhart traces. I discovered traces in the desert and forest areas, and at that moment, I felt great pain. In human terms, it felt like my skin was peeling off and my flesh was melting. Descendant, I suspect this phenomenon is caused by an inversion process. If Corel and Eamon had enough time after moving the Iron Heart, they may have managed to perform it. However, aside from this pain, I was unable to obtain any further information. For the properties of the Iron Heart to change, a tremendous amount of energy would have to be released. Void dimension, Lincoln Detected. Colossus is approaching. I repeat, Void dimension, Lincoln Detected. Colossus is approaching. Descendant, a colossus has appeared. This colossus, is it merely coincidence? Can this truly be unrelated to the Ironheart inversion? The ancestors always removed the environmental value of chance from all variables. They believed all things had a cause and an effect. My thoughts are all muddled. It would be best to focus on the colossus for now, Descendant. As for the inversion, I will investigate. Classification type, stunning beauty. All descendants in Albion, prepare for an intercept battle. <laughs> They're arriving on the daily! And not just any Colossus, but stunning beauty? Somebody buy Alpha a new- Descendant, the Colossi are discerning ingress through an incomprehensible pattern. Although the expected time of arrival for the Colossus is unknown, the fact that a stunning beauty is drawn here alarms me. Stunning beauty is a colossus which is insensitive to energy. Even during the apocalypse, only a few of them are recorded to have appeared in Ingress. But now, suddenly, one is making its way to Ingress. This is not a situation to be taken lightly. Descendant, I'll send you to the Void Dimension once you have finished battle preparations. I hope the intercept is successful.
Thank you. 